Great, fantastic. I think it's probably the best presentation I've ever seen in my life. I thought it was great. I thought it was very well done. Uh, not too many scare tactics and very relatable. I can't express myself. Uh, it was so funny. It was like... I, I never been in a show like this. It's so, so much fun. Really good and um, really enjoyed the way you I like it and, you know, I, it's changed my mind. Yeah. And I can, now I can look at you differently and I'm really thankful for this man. This show is absolutely fantastic. It really was very eye-opening. Um, you don't really consider those things. I was just saying to Paula that I actually have been in some of those factories in China. Not the ones that were doing technology, but actually we're making cloisonne. And I, I saw what he's talking about. And it's it, it really does make you think. And right now I'm being taped on a, on a, a device that was made there. And I'm wondering, hmm. And I have my phone in my pocket. And I have my computer in my car, and I'm thinking, wow. So it really makes you think. So I need to check out this paper. Okay, it was amazing. I'll never think of any technology. I thought it was really mind-blowing. I think it really will help people to look at uh, the world of different ways. It was, it was really interesting. I, like, I honestly didn't really know that much about what was going on. And it was it was um, kind of like catching in that he was like very, very funny. And then all of a sudden it got very serious. and. Um, it was pretty informative. Well, I thought this show was really informative and really entertaining. Um, being an Apple geek myself, I knew a lot of the information, but it was different, kind of having it portrayed in a different light. Uh, both entertaining and just kind of the information that he has that most people don't. Um, definitely, uh, definitely an ethical concern, which I think is going to be interesting in my future, especially. Because um, I'm, I'm very much like him. I don't know, we'll I'm see. Sorry uh, I be there. I, no, no, it's fine. I, I started thinking Definitely about entertaining and like, informative, that was for sure. I've seen two of Mike Daisy's show before, and what I love about him is his style of communicating with the audience and the way that he brings uh, real issues into the theater where they can be talked about. And tonight was a great example of the work that he does. It's just, he's an incredibly engaging storyteller, and the experiences that he shares are very powerful. Yeah, well, I just thought it was, like, really enlightening, and, like, I was reading the theme in the New York Times, and so I was just like, Wow, now I can see the actual person who like basically discovered it and like made it more public in the United States. So it's really cool just like having like I feel like he's not well, very well known, but like for what all he's done, I feel like he should be more well known and it's really cool that he's here and that we got a chance to like grab a hold of him and be like he's awesome. That that was an amazing thing. It gives me hope that I can do something. One person to do to talk. That's really cool be able to change something that directly just by continuing and being persistent and also he's a really awesome storyteller and I hope I can be that good someday. I thought it was uh, really interesting really informative and uh, I mean, it certainly puts the impetus on, on us as the audience to take the next step and um, you know try to try to affect change where we can and uh, I think it really calls um, awareness to not just the things that Apple does, but I think the things that all of the corporations do that we get all of our stuff from. And so now the next step is on us. And so I think that's a really great way to frame the show.